Welcome back traders. This is Sandra with Trading Made Simple and today we're going to talk about a strategy and that is the moving average crossover. Everyone has heard of different moving averages to help you scalp as well as intraday trade. And so what we're going to do as well as by, by the way swing, swing trading as well. What we're going to do today is I'm going to share with you a tool that it's going to allow you on Thinkorswim to actually back test um, some moving average strategies to see which one might be beneficial to the handful of stocks that you're looking at. So this strategy will be included in the description below and so let's get to it but before we start if you're liking this content please like subscribe and share. I really do appreciate it. It gets the algorithms going. This Technology blows my mind, but apparently it's supposed to uh, get it out to other people that it might help. All right. And then uh, if you want to be notified of future videos that I come out with, and you know that I always have videos, then hit that notification button. All right. Let's get to it. So this strategy um, that's going to be in the description below, you can name it anything you want to when you get it. Now, remember that this is not a study. It's a strategy. And so when you pull it up on your chart, you need to make sure that you're in the strategy, okay, label. Now, once you add that to your chart, you're now going to go into your studies and you are going to just pull up the floating P&L because that's Thinkorswim's backtesting tool that they utilize for strategies. Now, when we go into the systems uh, for this strategy, you can see that you have the choice of doing long entries as well as shorts. You can put your fast EMA and or simple, weighted, wilders, hull. You can um, do that and you can see that orders will be created based on the strategy you choose. Now a lot of people utilize the 9 and 21 for scalping and uh, intraday trading. So let's just go ahead and use that as an example right now. I'm going to hit apply. It's on my chart. Hit OK. So this is now the 9 and 21 on a day chart. So now I'm going to, uh, let's just say we're going to put this on a five minute chart. Now I'm on a five minute, five minute, five day. So if I wanted to see if I would have day traded a firm on Friday, how would that have gone if I use the 921? Well, it looks like it would have gone pretty good. So the strategy is, is that um, it actually tells you when to get in and get out, right? You see this little thing? It says moving average by 100. So in Thinkorswim, the strategies for their back testing is always about shares, not options. So please know that ahead of, ahead of time. I wish they did do back testing on options, but they do not. So the strategy for any moving average is that when the moving average crosses and you get your first uh, candle that actually clears your nine, then you're pretty much getting into the second candle and you're writing that up as high as it will go. And if you are confident in a retrace, then you can hold, but I tell you that if you're dealing with options then you're going to be losing money on this retrace right so clearly once it breaches your nine that's basically your stop loss that's when you get out of the position now my chart right here if you go right up here to your settings your chart settings you could go to the appearance and I have my chart right now on a Heikinashi here's a regular candle and you can see the difference in the candles right so here where it says to buy was red and then you can see the red candles that are in here all the way till you get to the top. Now keep that in mind as I just change this really quick to a Heikinashi. It smooths out the candles but keeps you in a trend. So now you can see that it's keeping you in that trend to the very top and then it's showing you the red candle and that is your uh, alert to get out. You get back in with the green candle. You can see how simple this is, right? Okay. Now, what this does down here is it measures your profit and loss. Now, we're on a five-day 
excuse me, a five minute one day. So this would have been if I would have day traded on Friday. I would have got in here and would have went here if I was buying the stock itself. Now it never told me to get out, but knowing what I know, I would have probably got out on the first red candle right here. So right here, it would have said, if I did the stock purchase itself, 100 shares, I would have made $447.50. That's how that strategy works. This is the 90 and the 21. So let's um, let's take a look at another popular one, which is a 7 and 13. Let's see if that would have been any better. $321. But you would have had to get in Ugh, get out right here, which would have been a bad area. You know, that happens. Nothing is perfect. Nothing, none of these indicators, none of these alerts, none of them are perfect. And so you just have to take in consideration that if you if you start to utilize these indicators and then recognize that you need to get out uh, as quickly as possible, unless you have profit, like it's always easier, right, when you have profit to hold on, the, on a minor retrace than when you're you don't have any profit and you're just losing money. So a lot of things to take in consideration, but this tool will um, help you identify uh, which moving average strategy you might want to use with different stocks and tell you how profitable uh, it might be to use that and also allow you to back test it, which is really kind of cool. So, um, also, the Heikanashi is on your chart setting up here. And you can utilize uh, the appearance of those candles to see how you better um, analyze price action with candles and what might be better for you. Okay? So I certainly hope that this uh, study helps you in making some money, saving some money. We'll see you on the next video. Have a great week. Hi, this is Sandra with Trading Made Simple, and I hope you liked today's video. My email address is in the description below. Email me if you have any questions on option strategies or training, think or swim tools or automation. We'll get you up and running in no time at all. Have a great day, and we'll see you on the next video.